Hey there WordPress fans, uh, yeah let's do another video lesson, tutorial, whatever you wish to call it. Alright, uh, today we're going to have a quick look at making your post look better. Because there are different elements that create a better looking post. So first we're going to go to this example of my site wordy.tv and if we scroll down you'll see that the the paragraphs are, are finish, finishing roughly at the edge. They're not squared or justified is the term we're looking for. We'll scroll down a bit more. This time it's this side where they're a bit rough and not to the edge. Once again, not justified. Uh, this one has been uh, <clears throat> leaning to the left and this one is leaning to the right. And we scroll down again. This one is centered. As you can see, it's rough around the edges on both sides. Go down just a little bit more. Once again, this one has been leaning to the left with the rough edges on the right. Now, same website page, but different result. As you can see, if we scroll right back up to the top, all the edges are straight and it looks much better in my eyes. Scroll down, once again, looks so much better. It's all nice and straight. This is uh, the term justify. And I'm um, not exactly sure what it means, to be honest, other than I know that it squares everything up nicely. Justifies the space that it's using up, I would assume. So scroll down again, once again, nice and straight along both edges. And um, a much better looking front page compared to this, in my eyes. So, yeah... Have a look at the front post here, the top one I should say. Scroll down, look at that. Look at this. I know what looks better. Uh, here's another website I have and also once again you can see here that uh, I justify the text in all of the posts because it looks better. Other than in this example here actually, I will show you that on the top, just this little bit here to make it stand out a bit differently I've actually centered the text. So um, how do we do it? Let's find out. <clears throat> okay, we're back to uh, wordy.tv and installing a WordPress theme. Let's edit it. And it'll open up in a sec. Okay, as we can see, this one is leaning to the right. So let's highlight, click and drag to highlight. Scroll up, go on up you go. And if we go here and click here, a justify, you will see everything has now squared up and used up all the space. We will update. And then we will go to the front page. We'll scroll down to installing a WordPress theme, I think it was. We'll plug in. Let's have a look. We'll soon know. Okay, here we are here, and you can see this is all install, yeah, installing a WordPress theme. It's all nice and square again. And if we go up, this is all rough on the edges. I know what I prefer. Okay, let's do this one as well, get it back to normal, what I consider to be normal. Scroll down a little, highlight, put the cursor up to make sure we highlight it all, justify. Scroll down, see, it's all nice and square along the edges, update. <clears throat> and these really do look so much better. Once again, we'll go back to the front page. Scroll down. Okay, we've still got the top one to do and also this one to do. So we'll do them all. This one has been has been lent to the left, uh, aligned to the left, I should say, would be the correct term. Aligned to the left means that it's all straight along here. Click drag, go up, highlight. Now we will justify. And here we go here, once again, all nice and square, 
much better looking. Now we update. Now on the last one I'm going to show you, um, as well as re-justifying it, I'll show you something else as well. Just wait one sec. Uh, this very first post, which is a sticky post, which means it always comes up as the number one post on the site, uh, it's, it's, a, it's a decent size post. And sometimes you might not want all those words on a page. Uh, might make the page uh, load a bit slower and so forth. So what we're going to do is I'll show you. First we're going to uh, justify it again. Let's go to edit. Okay, so glad you found wordy.tv. Sounds cool. Okay, highlight once again. Let's go up. Go on, up you go, up you go. And okay. Now we're going to justify, as you can see, as we've just done three times previously, justify. Okay, look at that. That's pretty cool. So now what we have here is we have a lot of text in one article. And that may not suit your needs or the look of your site. So if I click here, I'll go down, then I'll go back up. We've got an open line here. If I, I click more here insert read more tag see what uh, wait and see what it does on the front page it will make all of this part underneath hidden update and back to the front page just to show you what I've done that's the good thing about WordPress we have many options and yeah, there you go. Continue reading. So let's go, let's drag this little one over. Okay, here is the first press on this example. First press, first post, I should say. My, my apologies. And it's all of this. Yet when we go to this one, it's only that and a continue reading option. Let's push it. And there you go. We've got the whole lot back again. So uh, there's a couple of things we can do. We can justify, and we can also insert the more continue reading option. I'm going to take that out, actually. Um, I want people to read what I've got to say because it's the first post. So um, I've deleted that. Go down, backspace one. Update, and we'll be back to normal, as this will show you. So there you go. We know that, or we, I believe, and most pe most other people do. It's interesting now that you're aware of this. Have a look on other websites that you look at. See if they've justified the text to make it look a bit better. And also, if they've perhaps included the continue reading option, I'll just go to it, back to it one more time just to quickly show you where where it is. And uh, here we go. Here, once you click and highlight your text here, if you wish to justify, you will just click that. Now, if you wish to hide uh, the underneath section, um, you would go here insert a more tag and then if we update we might as well we're here if we update we will hide everything underneath the more section and here it is here the joy of WordPress is that everyone can get involved we won't see that on the front page yeah so here we go here and I'll just go up. The joy of WordPress. So there you go. Uh, I hope this has helped you. Um, there are lots of other options you can use when making your posts. You can bold parts of the your text like I have here. Uh, you can also do an italic thing here, which means leaning them to the right. You can see there's a slight lean on these words as opposed to these ones. There are options you can change. You can even change the colour of the text if you want. So um, 
we'll leave it at that for, for now, but I'd like to think you agree that to square off all the text fills up the space nicely and um, makes for a much more presentable blog. Okay, happy blogging. Um, Till next time. See ya.